Uh, Mike Davis is joining us, president of Article 3 Project, former chief nominations counsel at Senate Judiciary Committee, also a former Justice uh, Gorsuch law clerk. Mike, I know you're calling into us. We thank you for jumping on. The Supreme Court report appears to reveal uh, that it has been unable to identify the person who leaked this unpublished draft of the opinion indicating that the court was poised to roll back abortion rights. What can you tell us now that you've had a chance to look at that report? Well, I do want to commend the Chief Justice and the Marshal and the Supreme Court for putting out this 20, uh, this 20 page report. Uh, they are being very transparent here, unusually transparent for uh, the federal judiciary. And so they should be commended for that. It's disappointing. They did not find the person who leaked the draft Dobbs decision. But maybe it should not surprise us. The person who leaked this is obviously lying to these investigators because the investigators interviewed uh, all the employees within the Supreme Court who had access to the draft Dobbs decision, including the law clerks. There are four law clerks for each of the nine Supreme Court justices. So they interviewed all of these law clerks along with the permanent staff. Someone's clearly lying here. Uh, someone leaked this. Uh, and they did do a thorough investigation as uh, former DHS Secretary Michael Chertoff confirms uh, he, did a, he did his own independent assessment of the Marshall's report and did his own statement. So they're not hiding the ball here. The issue is that the person who leaked this is lying. And I'm wondering, there are a couple questions I have. Did the Supreme Court subpoena phone records, uh, uh, text messages and call records from the law clerks from their cell phones? And uh, did they perform polygraph exams on, on the law clerks or people who maybe even a narrower universe of people they were interviewing for second or third round interviews that they perform in a polygraph. And that's not clear from the report. Yeah, you know, real, real, real quick, if you could, uh, we, we had um, Jonathan Turley on a moment ago who said these are smart people. They would likely know how to cover their tracks. Just 30 seconds left. Yeah, I mean, to, uh, to me, it's obvious who did this. It, 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 I mean, if I, I would bet anything, it was one of the 12 law clerks to the three liberal justices just because they had the access to the document along with a separate leak of the internal deliberations and the motive to do this, to, to create chaos at the Supreme Court and try to cow justices to change their vote before Dobbs came out. Uh, so who knows, maybe whoever did this uh, got away with it for now, but it sounds like the report, uh, they're gonna keep doing this investigation.